Now moving on to sports, Mark Stoops and the Football Cats won their first game of the season Saturday against New Mexico State, and now they will jump back into conference play when South Carolina comes to town Saturday. WYMT's Jamie McCracken joins us in the studio with more on our Big Blue coverage. Jamie? Phew, Mark Stoops can breathe a sigh of relief today. Finally, the Cats get a tally in the win column. Now it's on to the South Carolina Gamecocks, a team Stoops has had success with. Kentucky will look for its third consecutive victory over South Carolina. The Gamecocks have a different staff than the one Stoops coached against in the last couple seasons. Of course, Steve Spurrier resigned, and Stoops sees head coach Will Muschamp's gradual development in the program. They're different uh, in, in certain ways. Um, you know, you see, you know, what they're doing uh, defensively is, uh, is, is the same. What Will's always done, it, it, it's just less right now. It's, um, you know, he, he just looks like he built more and more each week. Um, but you see the core of what they are defensively. And offensively, I think they're, they, they're changed. But I think much of what you saw last week, and then I th think they'll build off of that. Now, Stoops also discussed Drew Barker's status, and right now he is the starting quarterback on the depth chart for South Carolina. But he said he is dealing with lingering back issues and will consult with doctors throughout the week. The Cats put up 62 points, by the way, with Steven Johnson in at quarterback on Saturday. And coming up at 6, we will hear what Stoops thought of Eddie Grant's play calling. Angela. All right, thank you so much, Jamie.